Budget carrier Indigo is yet again in the news for all the wrong reasons after being making it to the headlines for beating up a passenger to being hit by wild boar in a runway. BCCL this time for a legal battle with the Delhi International Airport Limited, Dial, Owe partly shifting its operations. The airline had approached the Delhi High Court against the Dial's order to partly shift its operations to the newly inaugurated Terminal-2 from Terminal-1 from which it has been operating so far. AFP The Dial had asked three airlines operating from T1 to shift one-third of their flights to T2 to enable it to expand the terminal to meet growing passenger numbers. Defending its decision, Dial said T1 has already exceeded its capacity and if airline operations are not shifted partially, it would lead to overcrowding of the airport. Don't teach me how to operate my airport. Senior advocate Harish Salve, appearing for Dial said while opposing Indigo's plea. BCCL he said safety and security of passenger was the primary responsibility of Dial and in case of a fire or a terror threat, an overcrowded airport would have serious consequences for which Dial alone would be answerable, not the airlines. Indigo the biggest airline according to the market share contended before the court that shifting partially from T1 to T2 would result in confusion and cause inconvenience to passengers. By this decision, Indigo will be spread over three terminals as it operates international flights from Terminal 3. AFP seeking to quash Dial's decision, Senior Advocate Mukul Rohatgi, appearing for Indigo said the decision would strain its operations and proposed an alternative solution of giving the entire T1 exclusively to a T, and shifting the other two carriers to another T2. The dial had directed Indigo, Spicejet and Goya to relocate their operations in parts and split their operations by shifting flights to and from some sectors, namely Mumbai, Kolkata and Bengaluru to T2 with effect from January the 4th, 2018.